saw my, my note back that it was um, intro B that I had you do. Um, no, I didn't see okay, that yet. Yeah. Um, I sent you the the video. I didn't know if it was A or B. Yes. It yeah, was B? It was B. Okay, yeah, I'll change the title. Yeah. I'll change um, the title on it then. Yeah. I was kind of thinking it was, but not for yeah, sure. It's a longer one. Intro A is a real short one. Uh huh. And intro B is a little longer. That's kind of an easy way to remember them. So we would do like A and B like yes. in one day. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. You could, and once we get our canner down, we'll even do A, B, and C in one day. You know, because it's like if you go through all the effort to haul someplace and get there, it's kind of mm -hmm. like, gee, you're in the ring for four minutes, and it's like. That's an awful lot of work for four minutes. You know? <laughs> so she's a little stiffer on the feet, which is, you know, which is normal. Yeah. She says, I'm going to touch you. So the whole thing is go to the exact same spot on the reins. I go to where the webbing and the leather, you know, where the stitching, and then I go up to the stirrup bar. That's where I'm aiming. And I try to make sure I'm out of her reach so that she... See if it gets hot. We'll, we'll go in the end. So that was, since it was an aggressive action, then you're not going to accept that? Before we start our test, let's go left, okay? So say you're in the warm-up and you're about to go in your test and you're going, oh, she suddenly got really stiff on the left. So let's pick up the trot and let's do a small circle left because we need to get her softer on this left. So small circle meaning from track to center line, big bend, left leg, kick that hind leg, release. Keep the trot steady. Sit up, bend, 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 left leg, release. And again, bend, bend, left leg, release. And again, bend, left leg, release. Good, keeping that right hand low by the withers. Good, that outside hand's a little lower. That's it, bend, bend, release. There, now she gave, didn't she? Now we're ready to start our test, okay? So just head to the rail, and even, let's go ahead and turn left and start the test. So maybe, because we know the left is her stiffer side, that we need to take every opportunity to work it. Get that bend, get that bend, look at center line, get it, make her neck straight. X, you're going to walk and halt. So somewhere between her nose and your stirrup, perfect. Hold the elbows. So she never established the halt, did she? Yet now she, now walk and let the reins just be that half inch longer than when you would be trotting. Take a deep breath, elbows follow, turn right. At M, you pick up the trot. So in the corner, bender, shorten your reins, and trot. Good, and then you're gonna circle here in the middle from B to E. And your right circle had a really good shape to it, but the left circle didn't have as good a shape. Good. Yep, Roxy likes doing tests. She perks up, doesn't she? Isn't it funny how she changes? Good. Keep that left elbow under your ear. You're going to walk before the corner. Sit, walk, hug those elbows, close your thighs, soften your arms. Just a half inch longer in the reins because she's going to jig, so we got to give her a little bit of rain and soften. Think your knuckles, touch your neck, put your hands down. Good. And it's just kind of giving her that little bit of room. You're going to go KXM in the free walk. And always look that your wrists are in front of the saddle pad. Let your fingers touch her mane. Keep those hands really low. Good. And the elbows still follow. And then at M, you just shorten the reins an inch. And then at C, shorten the reins another inch and trot. Good, and trot. Now you're gonna have to work that bend. Work that bend, yep. 
and you're going to circle in the middle, bend, 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 soft, bend, bend, soft, bend, bend, soft. Keep after her. Don't give up. Bend, soft, bend, soft. Bend. There you go. Now use your outside leg, your right leg, to get a good shape to your circle. Now you got to use your left leg because she's going to cut in. Push her out. Right elbow under your ear. Left leg, bend, bend, soft, bend, bend, soft, bend, bend, soft. Straight ahead, bend, bend, soft. Keep asking, bend, bend, soft. Bend, soft, bend, soft, bend, soft. Good, now soft. Center line. Nice and straight. Prepare to walk. And halt. Elbows hug, close your thighs, keep your butt down. Good, then salute. And long range. Because she's going to try to wiggle. At the first halt, she kind of wiggled, didn't she? And she kind of crept her feet forward. So make sure you sit. Keep your thighs. Really suck your tummy in. Hold yourself. Don't be all collapsed. But really suck your tummy in. Hold your butt firm and still in the saddle. Because if you're too light and mushy, she takes that as, oh, I can walk. Okay? So if you're, if you're just kind of, you know, squeezing the thighs, suck the tummy in keeping those back pockets pushed and saying, nope, my butt's not going to move, okay? Then you can salute because the horse feels when you take that one hand off the reins and they want to take that step, okay? So as, you, as they feel you doing that, you have to be also feeling with your butt and reacting with the other hand and the elbow, okay? And just keep your butt tight, your tummy sucked in, your thighs on. And then, you know, when you put the other hand up, you can relax and walk forward, okay? Because we know that's the hard part.